Now, and as you know, Brian, it's important to search for positives. Yes. And boy, when you're watching NXT, you must search for positives. So when they introduced the eight women in this tournament, they brought back intangibles. Oh, they sure did. All right. And yes. Oh, man. For those of you who are concerned, I have written them all down. I will share them with you here. Nikita Lyons, striker, comma, brawler. That's their intangibles? Those are intangibles. <laughs> what? Ariana Grace, feisty aggressiveness. <laughs> feisty and aggressiveness? Aggressiveness. <laughs> not aggression. Or aggressive. <laughs> Aggr it should be feisty and aggressive, not feisty and aggressive. One is an adjective, one is a noun, and I'm not sure it's actual real word. Roxanne Perez, heart determination. Kiana James is doing the uh, York Foundation gimmick, so she is intelligent and strategic. Aggressiveness is a word. Okay. Yeah. Lash legend, confident, athletic. None of these are intangible. I'm glad one of the women on this wrestling show is athletic. Tatum Paxley. Strength, which is by definition tangible, <laughs> and mental toughness. Sloan Jacobs, crafty and scrappy. And Fallon Henley, tenacious and resilient with two L's. Oh, really? Yes. Wow. She's extra resilient. She's resilient. Res she's resilient. Oh, yeah. She's Hispanic. I think it works too. You know, yeah. I, uh, it reminds me Is that of, her first name is Fay Fayan? I've actually never gone to a psychic, but of course I used to do After Dark. And uh, it's like if, if you would go to a psychic and they would go, well, you know, you're, uh, you're stubborn, but in the right scenario, you're willing to look at, you're willing to accept other... Whatever, you know what I'm saying? It's like, you could say this to fucking anybody, and they're like, fuck, that is me. God damn it. I, you know what? I am I am resilient, and I am scrappy. It's like, what in the fuck do they even... It's like, God, intangibles. Well, this person's scrappy, but that person's not scrappy. They're resilient with two L's. This person's athletic. But Fallon Hemsley is not resilient, but damn it, she's a, a horse rider or whatever. I don't know. And then they have this match. Fallon, I can't even say I can't even say these two participants. Fallon Henley faced Sloan Jacobs. Yes. That's impossible. Oh, that happened. That's impossible. We did that goddamn name an NXT wrestler on Tuesday yeah. and for for 30 minutes total over 2 weeks. Not once could someone have come up with Fallon Henley against Sloan Jacobs. And the fucking virgins out there with a the Virginity Rocks shirt on? No, I didn't see that. You didn't see that? I missed the Virginity His Rocks. fucking shirt says Virginity oh, Rocks. You know, they're going, ah! Oh, Christ. And you know, I got, I got some... <laughs> I actually got respect for the guy because... He's leaning into it. He's he's, he's doing given, his job as best he can. He's been given a gimmick that you are a you are a virgin and you have absolutely no success whatsoever and a with chronic women. masturbator. <laughs> yeah, and and fucking he's like, all right, man, <laughs> like he's second only to Bodie Hayward is my favorite people on this show. Like these two fuckers will do anything, <laughs> which is why they'll probably both make a lot of money. They probably will. Now, they won't be like WrestleMania main eventers. No, or anything, they'll make a lot of money. They'll Vince around. wants somebody that'll just he'll do whatever the fuck he what you he wants you to do, and you'll put your all into it. That's these two guys. So we had the NXT Women's Lockup. Like you take two pendulums that's crashing crash into each other, and, and your leg has to lift up. Your leg has and to you lift have to up. Hop. And Fallon's doing her line dance, and the rednecks are out there. And Wade is suddenly very upset about this distraction. So here's a serious question about uh, the women's division, NXT, and the training thereof. Are these women only coached to make covers on one side of the body? Well, you got to face the hard cam, bro. There were m maybe that was it. But there were there were multiple times where one woman was down on her back on the mat and the other woman was going to make a cover, and instead of just lying down on her, she jumped to the other side and did a 180 and then fell down. It's so goofy. They do some stuff. Fallon, one with the Shining Wizard. Can you imagine, like, a uh, football game or something like that where the football players, 
in, in addition to having to play football, they also have to be the fucking director. So they have to make sure they're they're facing the right yes, way when yes. they run. You must catch the ball, but also yeah. keep your face on camera. It's not up to the director, the fucking lazy ass director, or the people that run the cameras. Like you got to find the hard cam, because fucking we're too lazy to find you. You you have to do your job and also my job because I fucking suck in my job. So when you're wrestling, make sure you find the hard cam. Which is ironic because the hard cam is on the side where there's no fans. So they're being taught to not face the fans, but to face a stationary fucking camera because whoever's running this fucking show can't figure out how to get a shot of fucking wrestlers doing wrestling moves. There's no other promotion on the planet. Ah, fuck it. Who cares? Move on. I can't do it. Old Excalibur. We've got heat with him. I was clearly joking when I said they sped up his voice. I had nothing to do with this, Mr. Caliber. <laughs> oh, now you have to apologize. His name is not Excalibur. His first yeah. name isn't Xavier. I like Excalibur. He used to be <laughs> yeah. a Caliber. If anything ever happens like AW goes under or whatever, you know they always have those those uh, those commercials about drugs, and they have that guy that reads the list of side effects. Yes, one out there. I, I, it's. Potentially lethal taint fungus. <laughs> that would certainly be bad. And I am not exaggerating that at all. <laughs> My point is, is they, I will they never re- take this drug under any circumstances. <laughs> Potentially lethal taint fungus. Lol. <laughs> Lol. I hate him. If you enjoy these videos, for just $7.99 per month, you can enjoy full-length editions of The Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm, The Mad Men Podcast, Speak Now Pro Wrestling with Denise Salcedo and more, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.